Days after the big snowstorm, a pair of parades had much better weather to help step into the holiday season. Wrapping up just a couple of hours ago, the annual Wilkesbury Christmas Parade. Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Espayat joins us live now on Public Square in Wilkesbury. Rachel? Hey, Mark, it was a lot of people out here, hundreds, some of them in holiday gear, ready to see the man of the hour. I want to see Santa Claus. The people have spoken. That's exactly who they got to see at the annual Wilkes-Barre Christmas Parade. Seeing Santa for the first time of the season, it's really a wonderful thing. The big guy didn't make his big appearance until the end of the parade, but smiling parade goers were all fired up and ready to indulge in the holiday chair until his arrival. My wife and I brought the kids down and my nephew for a fun day. I mean, it seems like the Christmassy thing to do. There's a lot of excitement. Um, it's very fun. Fun for our eyewitness news family, too, and some of our furry friends who helped add to the spirit of the season. Even people who normally don't go to this parade just had to be there. I'm not normally a parade guy. Like, I like Macy's Day Thanksgiving Parade, but I, I don't, I've not been to many parades, maybe one or two in my life. But for the kids, it seems like a fun thing, so I would like maybe those guys to be parade guys. Loyal parade goers basked in the fun that they enjoy each year. It's just nice to see that downtown so alive and um, to see everybody here and probably to try to um, go into some of the great shops and everything that the downtown top has to offer. It's really nice. At the end of the parade, they turned on these lights. Now, this was my first time going to the parade, and I had a great time, and I can't wait for Christmas to get here. In Wilkesbury, Rachel Espayat, Eyewitness News. I think after the parade, we all feel that way, Rachel. More than 1,000 people attended this year's parade in the Diamond City.